My name is George Prout, and I'm Chief Marketing Officer for GEMS One. And today, uh, Julie Hantman, who's our sales rep for the greater New York City area, and that includes all of New Jersey, and I are talking with Don Casares from Diamonds by Dawn in Riverdale, New Jersey. Hi, Dawn. How's your day going? Hi, good morning. How are you? Very well. Very well. It's nice to see you. Um, we wanted to talk with you just a little bit about why you selected GEMS One to be a, a vendor partner and what your experiences have been like. I think it's my understanding you've been working with us for eight years now. Am I correct? Yeah, about eight years ago, Julian came to me and he had brought me my first opportunity for a catalog in which you do all the buying for me, which I don't have to worry about anything. And because you are George, you pick the top pens every year. <laughs> and Julie does tell me which pieces are going to go well in my area. And if, God forbid, if they don't sell the following year, he takes them back and replaces them with something else. And it's no burden on me at all. So we started with you about eight years ago, a little mom and pop store. Since then, about seven other locations have closed down and we are presently buying a building of our own and expanding four times the size. Wow, what a wonderful, what a wonderful story you, you have. I, I guess at, at like a 40,000 foot level, you're less than what, 60, 70 miles from Manhattan. So there are probably more potential suppliers for you in the diamond jewelry business than anywhere else in the United States. You have lots of options. Looking from 40,000 feet, why GEMS One? Why did you select us? And what, did it, what is it that we're doing that, that is making your business grow? The difference between GEMS One and like my Gabriel and company and some of my other suppliers that they have all those items in stock. I don't have to wait four to six weeks for delivery normally for anything that's in that catalog. It's there and it's ready for me and I can have it overnight the next day. God forbid I sell one out from the catalog. I literally will get it the next day. And how's the delivery been late in the game, 18th, 19th, 20th of December, when customers are, start, are really pouring in? How, how do we do then? Uh, you're doing fantastic. And then recently we had a small little bump in the road, but your whole team went all out for me and they got that ring here in time. And between Julie and, and the other staff there, they reached out and they made it happen. So, I mean, you got to expect that, especially with delays going on, but but everything else you keep in stock for me, I appreciate it because when I sell something from the catalog, it's there for me and I don't have to wait that four to six weeks like my other vendors. Also, if I could ask, some of what you're selling from us is say under a 299 retail level. And a lot of jewelers express concern to me when we do talk about these kinds of pieces because typically in those price ranges, the product that they're getting from other suppliers is not the same quality as what they sell in higher price points. Can you comment on how our product holds up over the course of time now that, you know, you've been working with us for so many years? Yeah, I have, I'm glad you mentioned it because on the back of your catalog, you have items for $99. So Gems One and their marketing and their beautiful catalogs gets them into the store. And then it's my job to keep them here and keep them satisfied as a customer. So once they get here for that first time, they try me out and buy those $99 sales like you had always advised me will, will turn into engagement ring sales. And I've seen it time and time over again. They meet their sweetheart. They buy that first $99 item. I form that relationship. And then the continuing marketing, you know, like you got to drink the Kool-Aid. You got to listen to George and you got to listen to my salesman because they're right. They know how this system works and you do all the algorithms and the mathematics and the buying. So I don't have to worry about that at all. And it's always, I've seen so many of those $99 items which they've had a good experience. We wrap it up, send it out the door. The quality is excellent. No stone falling out. And they turn into potential engagements, which I prefer to sell, but it gets them in the door. So how many years had you been in business before Julie came in with Gems One? I've been in the game 35 years. Wow. So what you're describing to me is a scenario where you grew to a certain level and then you could not get above that level without honestly some outside help. That, that nothing about you changed. I know that if you get a customer, you're going to make the sale. What changed was the number of new customers you were able to attract because of us. Have I summarized that right? Well, yeah, because you provide me with that marketing materials that I don't have an in-staff person doing that full time. So I get these links from you, which are free. I don't pay for that. You send me those links. I repost them on social media, Instagram and Facebook. The catalogs, I, I just do that. It makes this little storefront look like a professional big box store, like a Macy's. 
because the quality is there and it's very impressive when they get here and then they see and then once they're, you get them in the door, they're mine. So, I know, so some of the jewelers we talk to are terribly concerned about maintaining an exclusive image. And I notice in, in listening to you, you're not really that interested in an exclusive image because you don't want to exclude anybody. You want everybody who lives in a 10 mile radius to come shop with you. Am I about right? Yeah, I just want to sell diamonds. And you know, yeah. if I put a battery in a Timex watch, it gives me the opportunity to make that relationship with someone. And the bottom line is I eventually end up selling them something. There's always going to be a graduation, an anniversary, a birthday, somehow, some way, but I become their jeweler from those little sales. You never know. Well, that's fantastic. You know, Julie, I, you have, have succeeded in New Jersey in an extraordinary way by identifying stores that generally have the kind of experience that, that Dawn has. For other stores, what is it that Dawn does that makes her one of the best executors of our program? How can we use Dawn's um, experience and, and basically put it in a bottle so others, what is it that Dawn is doing? that is making her so very successful? Well, I think the most important thing is, is as she said, she drinks the Kool-Aid. She uh, looks exactly what we do. She follows the uh, directions of our marketing department and she uses it to, to the best of her ability. And she's been doing that uh, over the last eight years with us and I think the success that she has has been, to a great extent, uh, a lot of it because of what we have shown her. Well, fortunately, I think one of the things that Dawn recognized immediately was the instructions, or let's say the directions and the recipe that we provide is, isn't based on ivory tower thinking. It's based on data. We have hundreds and hundreds of stores running these programs. And you know, there are a lot of people who like to kind of reinvent the wheel or do it their own way. But what I think we see in stores like Dawn is if she just follows the recipe, it's actually pretty simple, isn't it, Dawn? Yeah, you do all the work for me, like I said. And then Julie knows what sells for me in my general area. And there's times I go, really? And sure enough, it sells. I just laugh because he knows. He knows what's going in my area. And you know, he, he advises me properly on what to stock and what not to stock. But he's well, constantly bringing me updated literature and flyers that we put in and it's all at no charge to me. It's just, and it really makes my image a lot more professional. Well, that's wonderful. Well, I, I couldn't think of a better summation for our relationship than the fact that we have grown together in a wonderful way over the last eight years. So Dawn, I, I appreciate you coming on today. I hope you have a terrific day and go out and sell a diamond engagement ring to somebody who bought something in the Valentine's flyer, okay? Absolutely. I'm so grateful for all the help from you and your sales team, because without you, I wouldn't be where I am and where I'm going. So we'll, we'll keep right. making money together. Good stuff. All right. Well, enjoy the day, Julie. Thanks very much. And uh, Dawn, we, we look forward Alrighty. to a successful Christmas. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Okay, bye. Bye.